just walk all the way down the hall while they're peeking into their nice little windows there. Now, what does this do? Nice job, carry on. Alright, so we got a companion cube here. So, if we place this on this weighted cube switch here, that gives us another cube over here, and some light bridges. Oh, this looks fun. This is very fun indeed. Alright, so I need that portal there, it looks like. Very careful so as to drop down in between the aerial fate plates. There we go. Set this there for now. Replace this portal. Go back away. Okay. So now. What has that done for us? We still need to get in there, it looks like. Ugh. Um, actually, what am I thinking? Um, hmm. I probably do need this cube still. Actually, those are still up, huh? I'm, I'm, I'm suddenly confused all of a sudden. Okay, whatever. Um, I think maybe we do need this cube, though, to block the laser. So gonna do is let's, let's carefully move around here. Let's figure out which one of these is probably the one I want to take. None of these really seem like good candidates though. All of these are going that way. Yeah. Is there one on the other side of that? I wonder. Shoot. Okay. Got to be careful moving our way through. There is a hole there. There is a hole there, and I do not know what's down it. So, let's make a save. Walk our way around. There's a light bridge. What's down past the light bridge, I wonder? Hopefully not death. Whoa! Are you still there? Yeep. Oh, well, that wasn't gonna ha go well, regardless. Um, hmm. No, you know what? I'm taking another look, because I want to know what that button does. Just based on what I'm looking at here, it looks like it probably just removes that platform. Who's there? Or I don't need. Wait, what? Hold on a sec. What? So wait, what was it? The what, what was the what was the point of all that? Hold on, I'm confused now. You know what? Let's take the cube with us down there, or we could get launched into lasers again. And I am no longer in control of where I'm flying. Just perfect. Okay, we're gonna make another save. And then we're gonna take this and drop down. Still died. The cube helped, though. The cube definitely helped. I don't know. I'm just... At this point, I'm just exploring, because I'm not quite sure where I'm supposed to go. Oh, 
Three of those things. Pressing this just drops me into a vial of acid, it looks like. Because I don't see anything else down there. What is the point of this, then? Alright, so I just rushed the entire thing. Now we got th another cube. So now we have three of these cubes, and I have absolutely no idea what any of these are supposed to be for. Is there not like a passage or anything? Nope. It, this is just literally all to get one cube. And you need a cube to get it, so okay. So now the question is, what is down here? Press that. Lowers that. There is water down there. Wait, what? Well, let's back up for a moment there. Um, you know what? I'm going to make a risk and make a save, because I want to know what's down there. Th there's... I don't want to destroy that cube, because I don't think it comes back. But, I... Mm, Okay, now what's what's down here? Just water. It, just, what? Hold on a second. Wait, what? Is this just like a complete dead end? Am I actually just trapped in a, like a? I. What? What is the point of this? Well, here's the biggest problem. I, I, I can't get out now. I legitimately do not think I can get out of here without doing a little bit of... I dare say, cheating. Oh, this, this is really... I don't like this. This seems like a loose end from an idea that never really got resolved. I don't think I like it. I, I might not be able to get out of here under my own power. I might actually have to restart the level, and I'd rather not do that. It's just barely too high. I, I cannot get out of this. This... what? Is there, like, another... Sur no, that's like a laser grid into a... What is this? No, what what is this? What I I I'm, I'm going to have to restart and get back to where I was. This kind of stinks. All right, I'll be back once I'm back to where I was. You know what? I No, I don't have to worry. I don't I don't know why because these aren't actually hooked up. That's I feel like this is unfinished to an extent. Like, there was a lot of ideas and other things going into this map, but either he didn't quite finish it, or... Well, then this leaves one last question, actually. This leaves one final very good question, and that is... How do you finish this? Like, okay, there is a laser there, so I assume I'm gonna have to use these portals here. I'm, g I'm gonna see what I can do with a little bit of portal wizardry here. And we'll see what happens. Of course, this is probably gonna get me killed more than anything, but, oh well. So, we'll make another save. Whoa! What? Oh, hello.
Okay, so I can barely avoid the laser. That's good to know. Oh no, I fell down the hole. Shit. Okay, good news is there is a way out of this. At least he gave us this. Alright. Okay, but I'm going to have to go back and place this cube all over again, which is a kind of a minor pain, but oh well. Ah, I, uh, hmm. I, I, ju I just don't know how to feel about this map. Like, it seems like there's a few good ideas in here and a few nice little fake outs. Make sure that's in there. But for the most part, it just, it, it seems unfinished. I, I hope I'm not the only one who thinks that. Like, this first room here, this is kind of a really good idea for two parts. A, it's the fact that you have all these little jumping things around, and if you take one wrong step, it's like, oh, you get bounced around who knows where. I like that there are little pathways you can kind of walk around between them, so it's like there is still a amount of control or a little bit of a maze here. That much I do like. What I don't necessarily like is like, I mean, that part there, that was pretty fine once I actually got in there. This part was fine as well, but that that little that little place down there, I still don't quite understand what the point of that was. It it seems just like a trap or something that wasn't quite finished. This, this just feels unfinished. Like, there were certain ways you were supposed to go about this, and it, ju it just, I don't know. I'm not sure if I want to give this a thumbs up, because there is, like, it, it... I'm gonna give it half. I'm, I'm, if there's a way to go like middle, I'm, I'm just gonna abstain because like, I don't know. This one, this needs more work. That, that's my final judgment. This needs a bit more work. All right, so I'm gonna have to exit back to the queue and then go back into quick play. So I'll be back after that. All right. So our next map now is Repeater. Cave here, the real cave. Greg's been crunching some numbers here on Earth Prime. Turns out the likelihood of me being the only cave who likes talking to test subjects is... What's the actual number, Greg? Mm. Right. Zero. So, tell you what, we're going to use a code word. If I say chariots, it means you're listening to me. Otherwise, it's an imposter cave. I want you to know you have a license to kill on this one. What? Uh, Greg says that might destroy the entire multiverse. Point is, use your own judgment. License to kill. All right. So now let's move on to the next test chamber here. Let's see what we have here. We have a surface here. That is a pit. And that is a okay, okay, okay. So we got an excursion funnel here. Where does that go? It leads up into the portal surface there. Which looks like it might trap you if you're not careful, so. Okay. It looks like there's actually stuff up here, so let's make a save. Proper save, we're not going to go through that again. So now we go up here. Alright, yeah, it looks like there's actually a little, um, little tunnel back here. Alright. <coughs> let's see what's over here then. So we've got all kinds of buttons. And these look like they stay depressed. I certainly don't... Oh, okay. There is indeed a timer on those. That's a weighted cube. A sphere. All right. So we need a sphere for later. For now, we can at least put on this here. Now the question is, what do all these do? Okay, this is now an, ex an extraction funnel. So I just generated something with that button. I'm not sure what. That does something. And th this does something. That destroys the cube. Okay. Well, now I know. I put a portal there, an orange one, so that in case I need it, I can use that portal. Now we're going to go back down. We're going 
gonna get off before we land. I, I don't know if we can get out of there once we drop down there. Who knows? Let's see. Okay, so there's the sphere down there. Go ahead and take this for now. Now we got the sphere. So let's go ahead and take this back upstairs then. We got blue there, so... Take this over, and we can put this over here on the spear holder. Now, what do these do, these two ant lines? Let's take a shortcut back down. Okay. That ant line there, that goes to that cube uh, sphere dispenser. Okay. What? Where did those go? They went over to the other side. Okay. So now... It looks like there's speed gel over there now. Okay. So now, let's go ahead. Let's make a save before I do this. And let's take the cube as well in case I do need... No, because it'll go through the emancipation grid. Oh. Okay, well, let's assume I don't need the cube then. Let's drop back down here. Zoom through. Where am I now? Okay, okay. New room. Oh man. And this looks like it'll just take me the rest of the way to the end, it looks like. Yep. Alright, so that wasn't too bad. Pretty straightforward. Could use a little more direction, but I'm not going to be too picky about that. So let's move on to the next one. Make It Work by Mitch Rockwell. Welcome, gentlemen, to Aperture Rituals. Astronauts, war heroes, Olympians, you're here because of an ancient mating ritual etched in a monolith by the elder monks to forestall the end of days. So, who is ready to make love to a giant bird? Not me. I'm too busy doing testing. All right, so this might be the last test chamber for a while. Let's see what we have here. We got a nice, giant open room. It looks like we have every kind of gel here. We have... Well, this looks like cleaning gel, actually, so we don't have the white gel. Okay. Just confirm that. No, this is actually portal gel. Okay. There's, like, a cleaning gel as well you can use to wash off gels. I just haven't seen it yet. Okay. So, let's see. We got speed gel. We got... Bounce gel, we got portal gel, it looks like. Two batches of it. And, um... Um... Wait a minute. Was... What was the test? Uh, um... I, I don't know what to say. That felt almost like a first level kind of thing. Like someone just decided to build a giant room to play around with. I I can't really give it a thumbs down because... I, I don't know. I, I'll abstain on this one. I, I don't really know what I was expecting, I guess. Uh, let, let's just move on. Control these freaking lasers. Hey, Johnson here. Just want to let the cafeteria staff know to lay off the Soylent Green... I'm holding a memo from the president, and it turns out that Soylent Green is, let's see here, doubling in price. Now, listen up. I don't care how good people taste. This stuff's costing me more than lobster, so we're going back to fish sticks. All right, so I know I said that was probably going to be the last one, but come on, I was expecting, like, a challenge. So let's see what we got here. We got lasers. Okay, great. Let's make a save before I drop down, because we don't know what's going to happen as soon as I drop down. Alright. There is an emancipation grid there. So, um, 
Oh, okay, so I'm already starting to see the problem here. So now, if I try to pass through this, the door closes because the portals go away. Okay. Alright. I can understand that. Respect it. And there are laser catchers up there. So let's see what we happens when we do this. Uh, we do that. So now we have that there. And what does that do? It creates some stairs over here. Now we can get up here. And where does this button go? This allows us to drop down into there. Okay. But what would dropping down into there serve? Alright, well we're in a new room here and it looks like there's an excursion funnel there. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Let me see what's going on here. So what we're gonna have to do is a little bit of laser trickery here. I am looking into this portal the wrong way. That's a great start. There we go. Oh, nope, not all of them are activated. I don't think I even need these activated. I think I just need the thing. Actually, you know what? Let's experiment with that, shall we? Yeah, that's the only thing I actually need activated. Okay, well, in that case, then, that was... I don't know. As far as I can see, it doesn't look like... Activating those does anything. But since I'm a little bit stubborn... Well, let, let's let's go ahead and actually at least just set it up correctly. We'll, we'll go ahead and set it up correctly and just see what happens. Because who knows, maybe, maybe there is actually something that happens if you set this up correctly. And stop burning myself on lasers, that'd be really nice. Okay, so now we've done that. Now, to find out if that actually did anything. Survey says I'll probably have to come back down here later in order to fix that. Um, okay. Oh. 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 Okay, I see now. So why was there... Oh. Oh. Okay. I need to go through this again, it looks like, because I made a terrible mistake. So yeah, as I predicted, I am going to have to go back down there, but for completely different reasons. Let's go back up here. Here. And now what I need to do is we need to put a portal there and then go through here. And there we go. So a little roundabout. That lower chamber seems a little pointless with all those laser catchers you have to go through, but uh, otherwise it was a pretty good level. I did enjoy it. Well, I'll thumbs that up. But I think that's all I'm going to do for today concerning the test chambers, so next time we'll take a look at some more single player chambers, or maybe we'll look at something else. Who knows? For now, this is Solman signing off. See you guys next time.